For all those times you stood by me For all the truth that you made me see For all the joy you brought to my life For all the wrong that you made right For every dream you made come true For all the love I found in you I'll be forever thankful, baby You're the one who held me up Never let me fall You're the one who saw me through Through it all You were my Hi everyone, so I'm back here again with another tutorial. It is very simple and today I'm just going to teach you a little trick of how to get a perfect winged eyeliner. So to begin with that, I'll just show you the basic of this trick, which is to apply a cello tape. And the basic of uh, the most important thing in this is how you apply the cello tape. So like I do not really drag my wing eyeliner too far down and I like to keep it a bit up so if you can see how I've placed it goes up you should always make sure that your wing is not more than your eyebrow like longer than your eyebrow because that's gonna make your eyes look very droopy so that's how I have placed it and you can just place the cello tape in whatever angle you think is best for you and the next important thing to keep in mind is that both the cello tapes are placed on a equal angle so that your wing is equal. So if you can see, I've tried my best to make it equal. So let's just begin with that. So to begin, time. I'll be using a normal eyeliner brush and a liquid eyeliner. And I'm using mine is from India. It's called Lakme. So I just take the eyeliner on my brush. I just wanted to use a proper eyeliner brush so that you can use, so that everybody knows that this can be done with any kind of an eyeliner, even with a pencil eyeliner. So all I do is I start from the end and just kind of draw the angle. and go inwards if you can see I'll just keep quiet so that I don't mess up my line now and the basic is that the outer corners should be thicker but as you go in your line gets thinner I'm doing a thicker line than normal just in order to show you The brush is playing with me. So, just like so. I'm going to show you how I do it in my other eye, which I'll be more comfortable with. And I'll just use the same, this little brush here with me. Well, this is a better angle and I'm not worried that All I need is someone to show in the camera who makes me wanna sing take me to your heart take me to so all I'm doing is I'm trying to create this triangle here right, 
But as I go in, I make the line go thinner. And I'm kind of taking my ring slightly up than usual so that you know that you can actually create a lot of variations and different kind of wings without being worried. Just like so. So I'll just thicken the line a bit because in the other eye, on the other eye. In a bit from inside. So that's it done. And now apply some mascara. I like to apply two layers of mascara and I also tend to use two different types of mascaras one is this big fat one which is a volume one and one is this Rimmel one that I really like which is Sexy Curves by Rimmel the brush is like this just to kind of add a lot of length. Apply a little bit to my little lashes as well. So that's it done. I just remove the tape. And here you go. Look at that. And I remove the tape from here. So you get a properly wing. So that's how it looks. As you can see. Try my best to keep it equal and it's really simple and the main thing which is the most important to achieve a perfect wing eyeliner here is just placing your uh, sellotape onto your eyes because if your sellotape is placed properly and nicely you will definitely get a proper winged eyeliner just make sure that you do not exceed uh, the uh, liner or uh, the wing more than your eyebrows because that's going to make your eyes look very droopy and you should always have your wing going upwards and never downwards so I really hope you enjoyed this little trick of mine and I'll see you again with mine another video and until then bye bye and take care